Well, my name is Brian Nolenberg. I'm with Vico Instruments, and today I'd like to present to you Vico's Spectre Ion Beam Deposition System. Spectre is basically the world benchmark standard for precision optical thin films. It's producing the highest quality films available today at the lowest published losses and high damage thresholds with the best uniformity commercially available on the market in a variety of configurations offering a range of lot sizes from R&D to high volume production. The optical industry has seen a steady increase in the demands of the optical coatings over the last several years. This is a combination of increased complexity of the thin film filter designs, improved demands on the thin film fundamental qualities, the losses, the scattering losses, etc. And what that's been doing is it's been driving the industry towards ion beam deposition and away from more traditional technologies such as evaporation or ion assisted evaporation. And one of the benefits of ion beam sputtering is it produces hard coatings. So it's a highly energetic deposition process providing increased uh, material densities that ends up with very thin or very smooth coatings, low scatter losses. It's performed at lower deposition pressures than traditional E-beam or, or magnetron processes, giving you lower entrained gas levels for more pure films. We're actually able to achieve this at industry-leading uniformities. We have, we have configurations of substrate fixtures enabling uniformities as low as 0.07% on R&D applications or up to 1% on large volume applications such as the substrate I have over on my right here. Another benefit of ion beam sputtering is that the plasma is isolated from the substrate itself. The plasma exists within the plasma vessel of the ion source and is extracted out of the ion source using biased grid optics. The grid or the voltage bias on the grids extracts the ions out of the plasma vessel and accelerates them towards either the substrate for a pre-cleaning application or towards the target for a sputter deposition application. This, enable, this isolation from the substrate it supports more sensitive substrate materials. That could be a variety of plastics, it could be photoresist for pattern optics applications, etc. Ion beam deposition is fundamentally more stable than thermal evaporation, e beam evaporation, ion assisted deposition, and it enables many processes to be run on time power alone because of the, the fundamental stability of the ion beam process itself. However, for very complex filters, we offer a range of optical and non-optical endpoint control options. So on the optical side, we have direct substrate measurement provided either via a tunable laser optical endpoint control or for a broadband optical monitoring package supporting from 400 nanometers to 2,000 nanometers of wavelength range uh, selectivity. For non-optical applications, you know, for example, a customer may have uh, an application that doesn't offer any transmission through the substrate. We have uh, mass measurements using multiple quartz crystal monitors that allow the customer to both use that for endpoint control or if you use it for process development purposes when they're developing new processes for new material sets. Applications. We have a broad range of precision dielectric coating applications from UV metal fluoride applications, which were just recently released, all the way through the visible, the near-infrared, and the infrared. That supports a variety of end applications from laser actives for high-power uh, laser edge emitters, enabling the industrial industry, to uh, uh, non-laser or laser optical passives. And that could be anything from an anti-reflective coating, a highly reflective coating, a variety of thin film filters, could be bandpass, edge, notch filters, multi-notch filters all the way through dielectric gratings and planar waveguide applications. All of this is enabled across all of our fixture offerings with low temperature processes available, not only uh, to support uh, um, improved film qualities without the need for high temperatures in the, in the manufacturing process, but also supporting a range of sensitive substrates. Spectre is available in a range of configurations, as I already mentioned. Uh, that can be scaled by lot size for small volume R&D applications through very large 400 millimeter diameter planetary systems. We offer the system in a variety of semi-customizable, basically at order options that the customer can choose from to optimize the system for their specific thin film filter needs, as well as what they need to hit whatever their cost of ownership model and their throughput models are for their, their uh, manufacturing process. So in conclusion, 
IM Beam is enabling the continued advancement of the precision optics industry. It presently supports everything from bio applications with fluorescence microscopy, the medical industry with laser scalpels and, and protective eyewear for surgeons, the industrial industry with high power lasers for cutting applications, the communications industry for the telecommunications segment, optical passive, WDM, gain flattening filters for long haul, the aerospace industry and the defense industry for high end anti reflective notch or for uh, uh, ring laser gyroscope applications for guidance. Again, my name is Brian Nolenberg. I want to thank you for watching uh, my presentation on the Spectre IM Beam Deposition System available from Vico Instruments. And I uh, ask you to please contact Vico Instruments if you have any questions or interest regarding our products or how we might help you uh, deliver a quality thin film filter.